YTBC, this is your boy Coach Shelton Harrison, and in this video, I'm going to take a couple of minutes to talk about Dante's Boxing Nation, and I want to talk about that channel because I've been subscribed to that channel for quite some time, okay? I've been subscribed to it for quite a bit, and I actually enjoy the content. I enjoy that channel. That's one of my favorite channels, of course. And, you know, he did a breakdown of Deontay Wilder versus Savilka. And I always mispronounce the guy name wrong. So, you know, guys, don't hold that to me. Don't hold that. Don't hold that against the old coach. Don't hold it against me. But, you know, he was uh, he was making a breakdown in the video. And I thought Dante did a fairly decent job of breaking down the video. I thought he did. Um, and his breakdown was similar to a lot of people in the YTBC. Even people that really, they like Dante or don't like Dante. It's pretty much the same scenario, you know. Now, you got some channels who say that, you know, Wilder you know, caught you know, Sabilka with a lucky punch. You know, now, that's the subject for something different. I mean, I, I don't think the punch was lucky because he was hitting Sabilka with that right hand all night long. But, you know, okay, if you want to call it what you call it, we agree to disagree. That's just the way that is. But, you know, he broke the fight down typically how all of us did, really. We all broke the fight down about the same. And, you know, and I go down and just look at some of Dante's comments and, you know, in the comment section, he had a lot of guys, man, just hurling these insults at him. And so one guy, man, I just, I don't know why I did it. I just said, look, man, why you don't like Dante? And you know the guy reason, he said, well, because whenever I respond to Dante about debating him, he never responds back. And I'm like, you know, and I, I just said, well, do you think maybe it's because you're, you're insulting him and maybe people tend not to respond to people that insult them like that? I mean, I'm just asking, you know, I'm asking a, a common sense question, you know? Like, why would he insult, I mean, why would he respond to you and all you do is hear insults on his channel? I mean, I can imagine. Because I said, you know, Dante always responds to me. Matter of fact, anytime I've ever asked him a question, he's always responded and, and have always been very cordial and polite. And, you know, and I'm just saying, even when I disagreed with him, because one time I had, I had some words with him. I said, look, now, Manny Pacquiao is going to be a Hall of Famer. Now, you know, he explained, yeah, I didn't say Manny wasn't going to be a Hall of Famer, but, you know, we we had a short debate, and then we agreed to disagree, and we kept it going, you know? But, you know, I didn't get butt hurt because my opinion didn't match his, and he didn't get butt hurt. I mean, still, you know, whenever I ask him a question, he responds back every single time. And you wonder, you know, you, you're sitting there thinking, well, why won't he respond? Why? Well, why, why should he? I mean, I enjoy the channel. I mean, you know, and the guy, you know, and, and it really, honestly, one of his better videos when he did that all-access breakdown of uh, Porter and Broner, that thing was a masterpiece, man. I mean, really and truly, a person with a YouTube camera, a person that uses their camera for YouTube videos making an all-access video. I mean, ain't nobody ever done that. Like, Dante is doing a lot of good things, man, and he's doing a lot for the sport of boxing, man, you know, just being a YouTube channel, man. And, you know, he's doing a lot, man. And the guy's got, got his radio show. And it's like, every time I turn around, there's a video, man. There's a negative video about Dante. You know, and you got other channels, man. You got other channels that, you know, they have what they believe. They, they, they have their platform. Their platform is their platform. And Dante Point Blank told you that he's pro Mayweather. He told you that he's pro Wilder. He told you that he's pro Eris Landy Lara. And he loves Guillermo Rigondeaux. But it's like, people just don't understand so y'all will go to his page you'll look at the man videos you know what his platform is because he tells you this on a regular basis and if that's not your cup of tea then you know why even go to the channel like i have to ask that question you know i just gotta ask i mean i don't know because the man i've never seen him argue with anybody he just not and i guess you know some people get mad well he called people decaps that don't agree with him i mean but you know his platform you know what his platform is. You know what he thinks about a lot of things. So my thing is, why even go to his channel? I don't get it. I enjoy the channel. I mean, I, and sometimes I got to wonder, man. It, are, are some people really just jealous? I mean, is it because, you know, he getting all these fighters and promoters, like he getting Bob Arum, Brandon Rios, I mean, you know, Floyd Mayweather, you know, Oscar De La Hoya, all these people doing drops for his video, uh, Julian Jackson, they drop and drop. Oh, it's because he got all them fine girls in, in the intro, in the outro scenes. I mean, I don't know, y'all. But whatever he doing is working. Whatever Dante doing is working. Is working and the man is, is, is large. I mean, it's man, he all the way out on, on the West Coast. 
And there's people out here on the East Coast, man. Hell, my barber. My barber subbed to Dante, man. My barber. My barber asked me, you know who Dante's Boxing Nation is? I said, yeah, man. He said, man, that dude channel is popping. I love that channel. My own barber. My barber is subbed to his channel. And it's like, you know, it's real professionally done. I enjoy the channel. I enjoy what he talks about. And it's, and it's sometimes he's funny. You know, and sometimes, man, he just coming straight at you. And, you know, that's but that's what I enjoy. So I frequent that channel. I mean, I don't get it, man. It's really simple. Like, you know, people come on and you can disagree, man. You can disagree. But it's like, man, if somebody constantly hurling insults at you, you're not going to respond. And even on my channel, if somebody insult me, like, I'm not going to want to give them a nice response. Not, not even. But Dante just kind of chooses to not respond at all, which I can understand that. And it's not like, you know, y'all think the man got a short memory. So then you ask him a question. Maybe you do ask him with some common sense, but you, you don't remember that. You just maybe a couple of videos ago, you just called him a damn idiot. Like, I, I don't understand where, where people get this stuff from. I enjoy the channel. I, I definitely give a shout out to Dante. Definitely, man. You know, the man is growing strong. I like the video. And finally, you know, when I get out there to the West Coast, it's a couple of them guys. I, I definitely I'm, I'm going to meet up with, man. I definitely want to meet up with Ego, you know, because Ego's always cool, too, man. When I, Anytime I've ever left Ego a message, man, Ego pretty much will respond. One day, I'm going to meet up with 78. One day, I'm going to meet up with Dante. One day, I'm going to meet up with a lot of these youth. And I'm, I'm, I'm just going, you know, they cool dudes. They cool dudes, man. These are dudes with families. They, they all got, all of these guys cool, man. They real cool. And, and it's like, you know... People just, you know, put a lot of, hurl a lot of insults at these guys because they got an opinion, just like everybody. See, everybody in the YTBC, man, they got an opinion, man. And see, it's okay to disagree, man. I, I like people who would come on and disagree with my point. It's okay. I mean, people disagree with me all the time on videos, man, but I got more people who disagree with me that don't hurl an insult. They disagree and they say, Coach, man, nah, you wrong now. You wrong for that, S that SHIT right there. And I'm going to tell you why. And see, they break down why they think I'm wrong. And then we agree. And then if I say, oh, yeah, you know what? I see your point. Yeah, man, I think you're right. Like somebody on one video, they actually completely changed my mind when I read the comment. And I want to say it was Jaime October. I got to give a shout to my boy Jaime. And I actually told him, I said, and I think it was him now. If it wasn't you, it was somebody. And I said, you know what, man? I think you're right. Let me go ahead and I change the way I think about that because you're right. And it's cool. But it was a debate. We went back and forth, but we kept it civil. And I think some of us are missing the point, man. When you come on somebody's channel and you want to disagree, that's cool. You know, and even thumbing the video down is good because that means you don't agree with that. That, that That's cool. But when you the first time at a sign of an insult, there it is. There it is. You've already lost. Nobody ain't going to want to debate or say anything to you because the insult is emanating in their brain. It is. And I noticed that about certain people. They come to your channel and they'll leave an insult. They, they will insult you and then they wonder why they get blocked. Then you wonder why you get blocked. I mean, you know, I blocked a couple of guys, but, you know, the first thing they start is an insult or something stupid. Yeah, I've been blocking dudes. And, you know, I don't like doing that. I like people to come on here and debate. I mean, you know, I, I've never I ain't had to block Bring of Rain. I don't have to block Rascal. I don't have to block these guys because when they debate or they come on my channel and they disagree, it's respectable. And they kick in some serious knowledge from their end, like why they disagree. OK, I don't have to I, I don't have to keep people like, uh, you know, I, I don't have to boot people like uh, the fat king because I disagree with him almost every day of the week. But shout out to the fat king. I disagree with him a lot. But man, the guy is very professional. And if you look at his channel, he's very professional. He, he's not going to go at a war of words with you. He's just going to keep it very professional. And that's why I can debate these guys. or I don't mind, you know, really responding back to guys like that because they're professional. And that's just how it is. But I got to give a shout to Dante. You know, people say, oh, he's Dante's biased nation and all this stuff. Look, man, look, the guy got his platform. He told you what it is. So why go to his channel? And then some people say, well, I can go wherever I want to go. Well, you can, but you're going to get what he's telling you. And that's his platform. So you're going to have to understand that. But I love the channel. Shout out to you, Dante. If you see this video, shout out to you, man. This is your boy, Coach Shelton Harrison. I'm done.